Hey YouTube, Gavin with Jonquil Landscape here in the ATL. Uh, getting back to you with another video. Something I've been wanting to do for a little while. Just wasn't the right time to do it, but uh, wanted to do a little review on aeration. Uh, we're actually out aerating today. Uh, conditions are perfect. Um, we had probably close to a half inch of rain on a good uh, shower thunderstorm two nights ago. Uh, with overcast skies yesterday and then a nice uh, soft rain for a good 90 minutes uh, about dinner time last night. So we've been out first thing this morning aerating and I wanted to do a little review on uh, our aerator that we picked up last year. Uh, this is a plugger uh, PL835 uh, aerator. Comes with a Honda motor on it. Uh, this is a 30 inch aerator reciprocating. So it's not like the typical drum style that you get with the Rainbirds um, and some Ryans that are out there. Uh, I am absolutely in love with this machine. We did, or I did, uh, quite a bit of research to figure out which one I wanted to purchase because they're all uh, quite expensive for only having limited use throughout the year just with fall aerating and overseeding and then in the uh, spring with Bermuda and Zoysia. So uh, again, this is the plugger, uh, which is no longer around. Billy Goat actually bought them uh, out probably 16 months ago by this time and these units are now Billy Goats. Uh, they still kind of have the plugger name on it. Billy Goat really just took the same machine, painted it green, slapped about a $700 upcharge on it and uh, called it theirs. So uh, again plugger reciprocating aerator. Uh, we're gonna go out and do some aeration. I'll show you some results. Uh, again the conditions are perfect. Uh, you can see we have actually gone and marked our yards already. We're going to do this one. Oh, excuse me. That's our worker, Blair. Say hi, Blair. Hi, YouTube. Call him the Murph. Blair the Murph. So uh, we got these going. Uh, again, I'll show you some results. I uh, really don't have any editing software, so I will have to make a second video uh, and show you this. Uh, but again, plugger. PL835. It's a 30 inch wide reciprocating tines. There's only eight of them, so it's real nice to uh, to replace tines because the drum, there's probably 30 to 50 on them, I'm guessing. Um, but these, there's only eight that you have to replace. Uh, so it's real easy to operate. The unit itself to drop the tines. There's a handle here. Flip that up. The tines are now dropped to accelerate and kick them into gear, pull the bar up, and you're off and running. Um, this is not a self-propelled unit, but I will tell you it's about as close to self-propelled as you can get. The tines are probably at around a 30 degree angle, so as they're reciprocating and punching into the ground, they're pushing forward. Um, this model is, I believe, the SS, uh, which stands for super speed, meaning it's their highest speed unit. Um, there's an adjustable one, and again, Billy Goat still has it. Uh, where you can change the settings from a low, medium to high. But this one is the just the straight high setting, so you get good ground speed. Uh, the unit is quite heavy. Uh, if I remember correctly, it's about 290 pounds. So if you're going to have your guys out there doing this stuff, you need somebody that's going to be able to manhandle it. Um, you cannot be ginger with it at all. It will run away from you quickly if you run into some root patches under some oaks and other things. Um, or some hard hard pan clay. Um, it will not want to punch because it's again it's reciprocating so it will just ride on the surface because it's so hard as if you're going on a sidewalk or concrete or driveway um, and it will really just tear up the tines quite quick. So we are going to do these yards and I will do you a favor. Um, this yard here we've got the front and you can see between the house and then this little back area. I will mark this off square footage and figure out exactly how many square feet we got and how fast this thing will move. Uh, it is pretty flat, so we have that working for us. Um, we're gonna do the neighbor's yard here too. So again, I'll do a part two to this video uh, and I'll upload them separately because I don't have editing software and we'll go from there. Thanks for watching.